so I'm having a drink by itself. Okay. okay, now what we were doing a minute ago is we were trying to teach Sarah how to use the uh, the, the Hotec laser collimator to align the scope. And as you can see, we got the little the little, little, little laser beam thingy down there going on. We did get that centered at least. And uh, in the process of... Uh, it's taxing work, I need to say. In the process of adjusting the screws, the screws came out of the cell. It's... You want to show them a couple of the loose screws? Besides the one in your little pumpkin head? I'm gonna teach her how to do all these things because one day when I've gone on to my, <coughs> my great reward, see those are Bob's knobs, knobs. Because the, uh, the regular knob. But his name isn't Bob. His name is Bob. His name is not Bob. Bob, what? That's, that's who makes them, those are Bob's <laughs> knobs. Without these, you need a hex wrench to adjust them there. So we're going to. Hex take wrenches the are scary. So there's a little kit here, there's a little plastic bag somewhere down there. This is a Vixen mirror cell upgrade kit. We're going to go ahead and install that while we're at it. And eat a Reese cup. And eat a Reese cup. Uh huh. I'll do a Reese cup. So um, this is the. Thank uh, you for my Reese cup. Oh well, this is the Vixen 8 inch uh, F4 from 1999. So we're going to take a break and figure this out. Help. Okay, we'll be back in a minute. Okay, so now we've got the mirror out of the tube, and uh, Sarah's going to take the little clamps Sarah's off. Sarah's taking a picture to make sure she doesn't, like, kill anything. Take the little clamps off. Yeah, this isn't scary at all. Yeah. Do what? This is not scary at all. Just I teach kindergarten and first graders. This isn't scary. You sure? Not, no, not really. I put the screws uh, someplace where they won't get lost. Okay. Put them in the thing. They're all of them are. No. Yeah, I still got ice on my kneecap here from surgery a week and a half ago. <laughs> totally didn't touch that. The rationale is unless your mirror is virtually black with soot, you can't notice the difference in the images. It has to be really, really dirty, bad dirty before you notice it. Those are tiny little screws. Which is why I'm sticking them like this. And again, we don't want to lose them. Do you know I can't keep a hold of my head unless it's attached? Um, Probably not a good thing. Okay, so we're going to do the second uh, and third. Then we have to figure out the mirror upgrade. So this is a 1999 mirror cell, and Vixen had a couple of upgrades to. What I'm about to say here is I'm not making any sense to you. They got a mirror upgrade kit where it eliminates the fraction spikes on images partially. You have the fraction spikes. Uh, yeah, give me that thousand yard stare. How about this? Don't touch the mirror. One thing at a time here. <laughs> so uh, the kit's supposed to reduce the fraction caused by the mirror hold down clamps. I feel safer using my hand than the screwdriver for this. That's okay. Taking it off is the easy part, right? We can use some more light in here. Stand by. Okay, we're back. I didn't do it. Just say it. It's probably this spooge or whatever. They, I don't know what that word is. Um, <laughs> I don't even know what you're trying to say. Some kind of whatever we can get that off but so wait, wait are we gonna have to realign the thingy now uh, the, yeah you know what i'm saying yeah not the not the one at the top the secondary is aligned on this we got the secondary on the money hey good job sarah yeah this is this mirror cells hateful i've played with it before they've got some little side clamps that are you know pain in the butt Ooh, those were stuck yeah, Alright, that is done. They, they might have been, and the thing with the clamps is if you have them down too tight, it'll store up the mirror and make your images go wonky. Okay, so. Now one. grab it by the edges. The mirror by the edges. Is there a way to do this? With your fingertips. Very carefully move it off to the side. <laughs> Get it up. This out. Okay. 
put him on the carpet very carefully. <laughs> it's heavier than it looks. Yeah. Like, I was not expecting that. Okay, I didn't touch it. I swear I didn't touch it. Yeah, probably wouldn't hurt to have latex gloves on this. Did I break something? Nope. Okay. As long as I didn't break it. Ha! Take okay. down the carpet and slide him that way. Get him out of the way. Wait, wait, here, let's go. And keep him from harm and evil spirits and all of that. But yeah. Wait, so the emotional support animal, this needs emotional support. Well, he's next to his little brother. Okay. Way over there. That's the little brother right there. Okay? So okay. we're going to have an engineering break here and figure out what we're going to do next. Okay? Three, day, three days later. Okay, we get in there and Huh? We decided that... If <laughs> we I, decided that you were doing this if, wrong. If I don't help you, it works out better. Yes, we did decide that. If you didn't help, it does turn out better. Okay. But it's kind of saying something, isn't it? But you don't know how to do this next time. Yeah, I'm hoping there won't be next time for this part. Okay. No. There we go. Yeah, if we screw all the way in like that and... Uh, on and you have them turned backwards. Um, if, and if we have them like that, then we adjust them, we won't back them out so much. The mirror flops, the screws come out of the bottom of the cell. Again? Again. So, that just happened the last time. Okay. Whoever invented the, uh, the push-pull mirror cell system, that's what they're called. One pushes and one pulls. I get that, but one, whoever invented it all needs to be Needs to be shot. drug out in the street and shot. Or, or far, tarred and feathered or... Oh, oh I, know, I know. Make them teach kindergarten for a day. Yeah. Okay. Totally. We'll get it. Okay, do I have it right now? Or Am it? I correct now? Oh. Totally did this right. It's a story and I'm sticking to it. Okay, so let's uh, take a break and do it and we'll come back in a minute. Four days later. All right, how are we doing now? Eh. We got our screws in? All the screws are in. Well, and it's actually well, and it's actually facing the correct direction, Dad. Yes, the dark part goes out. The painted pretty part goes out. Well, when you got two great minds working on something, occasionally you have conflicts of intellect instead of interest. And I see you're not buying that at all. No, not at all. Get over it. <laughs> not at all. How about conflict of I'm right and you're wrong? Just say it. Identify the little <laughs> emblem behind Shorty over there. Oh, that's an easy one to figure uh, out. Maybe for most people, that's uh, the shorty next to the emblem for my popular TV series. Like so, we don't have enough TV series going oh, okay. on around here. here we go. Back in a minute. Hey, we're now in 2021. Happy New Year, folks. <laughs> hey! hey. Uh. Um, we're going to have to take this apart because the upgrade kit to the Vixen cell did not come Whatever with these are. They're side pieces to kind of hold the mirror from sliding around. Sure, we'll go um, with that. But uh, Point being is, is we put everything together before we put those things in. Here's the anti-diffraction line right there that goes around the top of the, two, the mirror. Yeah, whatever. So, um... That's about how I'm feeling at the moment. We're figuring this out as we go along. <laughs> yeah, all right, okay. <laughs> All right. So At least they didn't tighten them down. All right. Back in a minute. I have a question for you. What do you get when you when you get an electrical engineer and a school teacher working together on a project? A mess. Okay. Because you're telling. Wait. Let me get this straight. We had to figure this out together. Wait. You're you're telling me that I put it together. Wait. I took it apart. Then I put it together, and then I took it apart again, just to now have to put back. Together. But we had to figure it out. Hey! This is why you have instructions with your stuff. This is why we did not get instructions, apparently. They didn't send instructions with it. They figured we were smart enough to do it. <laughs> IT freak at kindergarten. Don't ask me to do math or put a telescope together. Apparently, they were wrong. Very wrong. Okay. Now, the upgrade kit has six side spacers with cork, whereas the old original had three side spacers with broken pads on it. And this has sticky. Uh huh. I don't like sticky. Just saying. Well, all right, I'll move back a little bit. Still doing it. Okay, we got the little mirror clampies in there. They're the cork the new Vixen mirror clamp, and Sarah's going to get the mirror very. Yeah, very but see, here's the thing: if we shake it, they fall down, and then we then, have sticky on stuff. Then don't shake it. But it's. Don't touch the mirror surface. Any other don'ts I should know about? Don't freak out. Don't, don't lose your mind. Don't be a hater. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Oh, so many comebacks at all time. Okay, so wait, I'm assuming the... I didn't touch it. You just have to exercise <laughs> an extreme level of care. I did touch it. Sorry. And if you damage anything, it will lead to a so lifetime wait, of... So wait, the little... I can't touch the back, can I? Yes. Okay. Woo! Just check it. Uh, let's, let's, let's just get the job accomplished. Yeah, let, let's. I will be quiet. Don't shake it. Don't drop it. Don't touch it. Is it in? It's not in. <laughs> Is it in now? I can't tell. We're going to assume it's in. All right, let's, get, let's examine it. I'm pretty sure it. it's actually not in. If you lift it up. It's see, not in. I'm telling you, it's not in. So if one of the little clampy things pops out into the hole, you've got to start over. It yeah. did. Uh, okay. It popped out. I started. Zounds! By the way, you're getting. I'm seeing a lot of gray hairs up there. I know, right? Yeah, I know. There's six of these little a, a pseudo adhesive cork metal pads here to. Damn it! To keep, <laughs> to keep the mirror from sloshing around side to side. Yeah, I know. And they don't fit! Yeah, they fit. Well, they stick. Like, hold you know one, what? Hold one up so we can see it. Yeah, there's six of these in a Vixen Mirror cell. It, it, Here, there's, there's would you like to take a picture of where it goes? You're just moving it around. I couldn't even get a, a zinger on it before. Don't move your hand. It kind of looks like a second lieutenant bar. Okay. Yeah, it sticks, too. Yeah, okay. Moving on. Back to work. <laughs> Back to work. It goes in those little holes. Yes. And then they slip down, and then you, like, it's, cuss. It's a hateful design. I'll be the first to tell you. Crackers. Uh, yeah. Cuss like a teacher. Okay. You ain't getting this one back. <laughs> I'm sorry. It ain't happening. You are not getting it back. You needed a break. Actually, you need a brick. <laughs> Actually, I need that mirror to go in now. Well, we got to get the clampies figured out first. I don't need a clampy figured out. I don't know how the clampy. Well, once you get the mirror in there, we ain't got to worry about it no more. I know, but this one isn't going in. That's the problem. Oh, well, we'll see here now. 20 billion at this point. Okay. He's not going in like he's supposed to. I hate to tell you that. Stay. Yeah. He's not flush. Okay. No, now he's fine. give up. All right, let's try this again. Right. Don't touch the mirror. Don't touch the mirror. Don't break the mirror. Don't play around with the mirror. Yeah, you know that ain't gonna happen. All right. Okay, this is the one that's being aggravating, so we'll go. Is he in? No. <laughs> Look, well, he's now. got so much wiggle room. Well, that that'll that'll resolve itself. They need the clamps fall down. Yes. No, that one's just not flush to anything. All right, let's play switcheroo again. Okay. All right. No, oh. I don't got it. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. So I dropped it. You dropped it. I dropped it. Okay. Um, Why won't it sit right? Now, for those of you who are wondering, you know, this, this is the first time Sarah's ever done this. And she's smarter than average, so you're average. I am? Uh, yeah, my book okay. you are. So the average person uh, trying to figure this mess out would probably uh, scream, contemplating uh, self-destruction at this point. I'm very close to it. Uh, that one just doesn't want to sit flush. And you uh, remind me how much you like astronomy. Uh, we were doing good till we had to teach you how to collimate the scope, and things went south from there. Right? If I have nothing, I'm determined. Okay. After all, I already bought the camera um, case to go with my instant camera. Yeah, so. well, should we um, maybe take a break and get something to eat? Oh, no. It's a challenge now. Okay. All right. It's going to be me versus this telescope, and I will win. Well, that's the mirror cell. So right now you're... It's walking. parts of the telescope. It's like brain it's, surgery without a body. It's an integral subassembly of the optical tube assembly. Pushing the cork down. Okay. It's not going to work. Now, but I can so try. this is your version of saying put a cork in it? Yeah. See this Reese's cup? Yeah. Eat it. 
Oh no, you're gonna eat it. Okay. <laughs> it's not gonna be free. All right, give us one more Sarah go. Sarah got two big bags of Reese's Cups. There's one bag, little snack-sized Reese's Cups. There's one. They're regular-sized Reese's Cups. Oh, Thank regular you. Yes, they're regular. And her birthday was last week, and uh, God help us all. She had a good birthday. Um. Yeah. Nobody she, killed themselves. We're good. And she got two bags of those for her birthday. And this one. You got it. I got it. Wait. No, uh, that's way too good to be true. There. I got it. Yay. <laughs> oh, Susanna, don't you cry for me. I don't know that goes. I need a reward. <laughs> Are you going to say, I am woman, hear me roar, or some other BS like that? No. You're not going to kill your dad? No, I'm good. Okay. Because if I kill him, then he is no use to me anymore. Of course, then the telescope would officially, ooh, the telescope would officially be mine. Huh. No, I still need you. We gotta get the, after the mirror gets back in that thing. Then your life may be cut short. Ow! Shut your mouth for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Online teaching, y'all. There's something called a mute button. Beautiful, beautiful button. I can using only imagine Mi using Microsoft Teams, right? Zoom. There's oh. still a mute button. Doesn't matter what program you're using. There's still a mute button. Kids get loud, mute. Boss gets on your nerves, mute. Eh, your mama calls you from her school, mute. It's beautiful. Okay, let's take a break through the next step. I already know the next step. Sure you do. Dinner. Uh, you said you didn't want to eat a minute ago. We gotta get that back in there before we can eat. Oh. I am eating, what you talking about? Well, the rest of it's easy, while it's speaking. Famous last How word. does this go on? We'll figure it out, it's easy. Yes. Okay, so Sarah's wanted to proceed to the final step of reassembling. The well, no, actually, the final step would be like screwing that back together. So well, yeah. don't get too excited. Well, well then we got to call me the scope without removing. And don't the touch the mirror. Well, yeah. It's going to get more difficult as we keep going. And that goes there. And that go I'm assuming this can touch the mirror. Yes, that's the circumferential mirror hold down assembly. It's frisbee with no metal. And it's a it, round thingamadigi that reduces, holds the mirror in place. It, it reduces the aperture slightly by covering up the area of the mirror clamps. How about this? If you turn this over and the mirror falls out, you're going to have a problem. It is a, so it is it is a diffraction reducing widget. Is there an acronym for that? DRW. Drua. Drua. I you say DRW? Drua. Dumb. Oh, <coughs> Alright, this is not going to be fun. Okay, cool. Of course it'll be fun. You're spending time with your dad. Don't, wait, you do realize there's little smudges here from where the old plants were, and yeah. I did not line them up. Well, the, the little ring here is going to cover those up. The thing is, we'll leave them in there and just to avoid touching ah. the mirror. Hey, hey. What? Hey, hey. That would be discovered now. That I got the problem. Now, we do not use a power driver um, to put the screws into that. Yeah, don't touch the mirror. I feel like there's a bad joke in here somewhere. Say what I feel like there's a bad joke somewhere in this. Uh, not going to comment on that. we got to keep the video at least PG rated. I wasn't trying to be nasty. Well, good. I, don't I still think there's a joke somewhere in here. A perfectly yeah, legit right joke. In front of me. <laughs> I didn't make that sound for you're the right. record. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. Don't touch the mirror. Got this. You know, it would be an advantageous to wear latex gloves and doing this kind of work, I wonder. No, because you get fingerprints through latex gloves. Well, the latex. And if you get one small, if you get them too small, and they leave fingerprints through the gloves, and if they're well, too finger, big, well, you finger, just drop things. Well, fingerprints. Ask me how I know. Does, more, does salt water go through latex gloves? That's no, why. No, but you st if you. Never mind. If, if you cough on your hand, you're leaving moisture on your hand, and therefore can leave a fingerprint. If you cough on a glove, or you touch yourself 
skin you with put on a fresh, You put on a fresh pair of gloves and you don't cough on them or rub your nose with them. Or don't touch yourself. Okay. Weird Work. eye. Weird eye. Work. Working. You're worse than my boss. Jeez. No, I'm not. And yeah, you're at least semi human. <laughs> I don't know. I wonder if the. Um, I have several bosses. One of them is my mother, so. <laughs> you see a little mirror spot there. I didn't do it. I did that. I didn't do it. Alright. Yet. Yeah. Yeah. Big yet there. Alright. Alright. Well, screw this thing down. Yeah, we get this to... I kind of miss the clamps. Um, now the screws, you use the screwdriver, of course, right by that leg down there. So that's right there. Ha. Next to the Reese's cup that you just ate. And this really awesome camera cover. We'll talk about that later. On point. On point. Stay focused. Poster child for ADHD over here. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, once the screw stops rotating easily, you don't want to snug it down, is what I'm saying. Because if you apply pressure to the surface of the mirror, it will distort and cause aberrations. So, wait, now I feel like I need to do this. You got to be careful. I feel like I need to do that now. Yeah. How about this? I let you tighten it down. No, you got to learn how to do it. And if we have a pinched mirror, when we're done, we'll have to take the mirror out and loosen the screws. At least we don't have to take this assembly apart again. No. So snug, uh, but is, not... Uh, this is the review of the Vixen Optics R200 SS Mirror Cell Upgrade Kit. What's your opinion of the upgrade kit? My, you know? honest, my honest opinion? Yeah. I know. That bad. Like, I think they had two upgrades to this mirror cell since they made it. This was the well, it wasn't horrible. It could have been worse. It could have used instructions. Yes, instructions must come with things. Whether you use them or not is your choice. But please give me the option to throw it away. And, and then dig the, it out of the trash can. Uh, the collimator, laser collimator, is by a wonderful little company called Hotec. H-O-T-E-C-H. -E no kidding. Hotec. So many jokes, so little time. Uh, yeah, well, we're not going to say that. So many jokes, so little time. We're just waiting for your big Astro endorsement contract to come through. Not. Yeah, that ain't going to happen. We already know that. I think you're the cutest girl on YouTube right now. Well, for the record, um, I already got an endorsement, thank you very much, from my co-teacher who brought me 48 Dr. Pepper. I think that's endorsement enough, that right? That was a wonderful birthday. That was a great birthday gift. She said, don't drink it all at once. <laughs> Oops. All right, let's take a break here. Dad's going to move right. his leg. One more. Actually, two more, but whatever. You guys take a break if you want to take a break because we're going to come back 20 years oh, later. Dad here had a medial meniscus tear, which he had to get fixed on October 15th. Let's get something clear. He wasn't that graceful to start with. Um, Neither way, Ma. But, uh, you know. Okay, I don't think I did it too tight. We did some fentanyl, some bursit, and some cetylforane. I don't think they gave me propofol. It was only a 30-minute procedure. Got two hits it did not shut him up, I promise. No, it did. I told, uh, I told the, uh, the gas passer, Dr. Uh, Dr. Ty, I said, well, he gave me a bursit and uh, fentanyl, and I'm still here. He says, well, we'll fix you up here in a minute. Okay, I take it if there's that much play in it, something I'm have rough. to look at that. Yeah, seriously. We're back in the day. All right, we're back. We now have the uh, new... My OCD can't handle this. I'm just saying. And it removes the effects of diffraction from the mirror clips. We lose a little bit of aperture, not much. Oh, there it is. Just making sure the... There we go. ...circumferential main operating wing is not too tight. <clears throat> okay. Think good. The main idea is to keep that mirror from flopping out of the cell. Yeah, well, as heavy as that mirror is, that piece of plastic is not going That's to That's actually about half the th thickness of most mirrors. The Vixen mirror is very thin. It's just their design. That's a dirty mirror. Oh, well, it's not dirty enough for the rest cleaning it. If you say so! Yeah, 
God's sakes, I don't want to touch it. You be you. You be you. You do you, boo. Every time you clean it, you risk scratching it. Every time I look at it, I risk knocking it over. I'm just saying. Okay. You want to hold it up carefully? Okay, carefully. Thank you. Yeah, it is dirty. I told you. Wait, look, I'm like shining it in the mirror. Well, Don't shine it in the camera. Yeah, we're just, uh, it's not dirty enough to clean it. There's a, a couple of schools of thought on that. And, uh, <laughs> you know. It's not even a little too much fun here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Can I put this down before I break it, please? Let's put it back in the tube. Let's say. Yeah, you want me to pick that up and put it on top of that? No, we're not doing it that way. Thank God. <laughs> you got this all messed yeah, up. Yeah, I know. Yeah, you know? All right, let's loosen that up. Yeah, we'll bring we've got the mirror back in the cell here. Not a mirror cell and the mirror back in the tube. There we go. I'm an electrical engineer. I'm not a mechanically inclined person. Yeah, really. obviously. Well, then <laughs> Neither am I. That's the problem. You're better than I am. I ain't saying a lot, but there you go. <laughs> yeah. This is heavy. Just saying. Yeah, yeah. I mean, things don't line up right. Get a hammer. <laughs> don't tempt me. All right, let's do it this way. All right. This, of course, That's good. Ah, there we go. This is the Vixen. There we go. <laughs> Sort of lines up, not really. Mother. You could get the uh, straight hex wrench and kind of snug the hole a little bit. Cracker snatchers, beef stew. Have you ever noticed teachers cussing food? Just say No, I don't hang around teachers <laughs> usually. Except for you. Yeah. That's kind of a I can't get out of situation. Just the way it played out in the grand scheme of things. Hey, maybe it helped if we took the finder off of it. Yeah, it might. Let's take the finder off. Yeah. Because we're bright people like that. And we're very bright people. We're going to take the finder off. And the auto guider as well. I had that stuff. You over there. really did not think this through, did we? <laughs> we did not think this through. Yeah, well. Why will you not line back up? You are not. I don't like you anymore. <laughs> we'll get it. Oh. Okay. Hey, can I put it down now, please? There you we got, go. You got all the screws in? No, I don't have all the screws in. All the braking parts are uh, no longer be no longer attached. Thank God. Okay. I thought kids were going to drive me to drink. Telescope might just do it. Well. You're going to say, Daddy, I want to play, play with the telescope. I want to play outside under the stars and look at meteorites. What was I thinking? Meteorites and satellites and megalos and you know, all of those things. I said, are you serious? He said, yeah. Yeah. Remind me. Am I ever serious? The whole idea of coming up with this whole rig here was to control remotely from the comfort of our house. Cheater. Yeah, no, I don't have it. I have to take a moment because I might just scream. We're late to the game. Folks have been doing this for years. Remote astronomy, they call Glad it. Glad I cut my nails before this because if I broke a nail, you really would hear me go. Mm -hmm. Be by your own hand, baby. I right? know. That's why I don't have nails. Keep okay. them still. This is for real why. I teach SPED. I teach special education. You don't need nails for that. I'm going to clean the tube up and then we got to do some hard work. Stickers. Right? Yeah, that's going to be, yeah, sure. This is not fun. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I got an idea. Let's take a Don't break. scream? Yeah, let's take a break. Okay. Things should not be this difficult. Well, it's your first time doing it. You know, it's your very first time doing this. It's not the bugs that's going to get me. It's not being able to take a picture. It's putting the thing together that's going to tear, well, take the... you know, the next time you do Ooh. this, when you have to do this, it'll be easier to do this. Oh, I and think I, I might have got it now. Uh, you know, what was the little guy, his name, who got killed, who says, uh, I have spoken? What's his name? Okay. 
Yeah, I don't know off the top of my head. It's been a while. I need to rewatch them. The Mandalorian. Yeah, I know. You do realize how many things I have to remember on a daily basis, like get up. When the next season is of the Umbrella <laughs> Academy and things like that. Uh, yeah, exactly. Like the Mandalorian's coming out yeah, the thirtieth. Yeah, yeah, totally need to remember that, things. The answer on that is no time soon for the Umbrella Academy. Mandalorian's coming out the thirtieth. I know it is. It is uh, ooh, ooh, Friday. Ooh, 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 ooh. Maybe. Please work. Please. <gasps> Yay! Now you can tighten them all up? Yep. Now I can tighten them all up again. Oh, okay. yeah. Yeah, this is the older Dixons. Uh, I had to change the screw out. It has the, uh, hammer, uh, the hammer tone green finish on the focuser and the other, and the other uh, accessories, including the mount and the... Uh, Finer brackets, uh, also the same. For color. the record, a screw is not going to get the best of me. As many things as I put together, the telescope will not get the best of me today. Well, I'm proud of you. you did Maybe. A, you've done a good job on this so far. Yeah, when you quit. But uh, you're an expert at doing 3D puzzles. Because I, I, saw you like did over, I saw you did over the summer. Three no, no, no. They're pandemic puzzles. Get it right. And then, well, you're at uh, Nene and Poppy's. So what else were you going to do over the summer? Yeah, there wasn't a lot to do. Okay. Oh, I do have a 3D puzzle of Santorini downstairs for you. All right. So let's, uh, all right. Okay. All right. This, I think we're... Uh, let's get our terminology correct. This is uh, your scope named Cora. And the Cora is a Vixen model what? R 200 SS. I don't remember this stuff. 8 inch F4, right? Sure. Trust me on that. I'll remember one day. Okay. I think it's about the lightest uh, metallic uh, eight, uh, tube F4. You're killing about, me. About uh, 13 pounds. Ooh. Everybody else's is a lot heavier. Stickers. We gotta clean him up first. Stickers. Okay. <laughs> that was easy. All right. I'm hungry. Oh, you got a scratch? I told you he's got scratches on oh. him. He's been used and loved, as the word is. Yeah, uh huh. He will be in much better care now. Sure. <laughs> Sticker! Oh, there's a disclaimer right there. Our favorite disclaimer in all of astronomy. What, that things are further away than they appear? No. <laughs> Don't look through it or you'll go blind? Yes. Ah, uh, gotcha. Warning, if you see a bright white beam coming out of here and the scope's pointing to the sky, do not stick your during the day? ball in it during the day. That's a very strong disclaimer there. How many kids have holes burned clean through their skulls? I don't know. None of mine. No. I tried to teach mine good. <laughs> anyway. Let's Sticker go. time. Yep. Thank God. Thank God. I'm tired. All right, let's go do <laughs> some me out. Hello, everybody. Stickers! Bye. Stickers! Goodbye.